Now it's time for step five, proofreading and editing, time to make corrections. Although you've been given peer feedback in step three, and some of your peers may have given you some tips on how to improve your spelling and grammar and punctuation, it's time for you to look at your essay and determine what needs to be corrected and what may have been overlooked. So let's take a look at the, the checklist. How can I fix this? You wanna make sure that you've indented each paragraph. You wanna make sure that it's not one long paragraph and that you have broken them down into multiple paragraphs. And again, indenting them. Did you use complete sentences? You wanna make sure that you have a complete thought and that you don't have fragments and run on sentences. Did you use correct punctuation? Did you spell each word correctly? And did you use transitions effectively? We are very fortunate in that we do have Grammarly that can help us with our spelling and grammar and punctuation. So you also have that to help you make corrections. So not only have you had your peer feedback, you also have that great resource of the Grammarly. Now, some of the tips that you wanna keep in mind to help you make sense of your writing and to make sure that you don't have any mistakes is by reading your piece out loud. Ask yourself, did that sentence sound right? So hearing it out loud is very helpful. You'll want to reread your writing several times. Each time focus on something different. For example, you might wanna focus on punctuation first in one reading and then spelling in another. And especially if you know that certain areas are your weaknesses, you'll definitely wanna target those different areas while you're reading. You'll also want to delete unnecessary words and phrases that may clutter your narrative. Are there too many words when one strong, precise word may work better? And that's where the good word choice may come into play as well. So these are the things that you'll want to keep in mind when you're going through this particular step. And now you're that much closer to putting together your final copy for step six in publishing.